Because in Vegas, I, I, we do a lot of working out because you've got a lot of the young people that are always on stage. Absolutely. Victor, how are you? I'm doing wonderful. Thanks for having me too. Oh, absolutely. Because I want to keep getting you out there and, and letting people understand that your, your body is really the only thing you have. Think about it. That's right. That's the only. It's the only thing you live in. It's the, only thing, it's the only thing you live in. You might That's live right. in a house, you might live in a car, I don't know where you live, but the only real thing you live in is your it, body. Yeah, and the skin is the largest organism. Yeah, yeah. and then we always see the, this is what I always say to people, we, we always see the outside. We right. see what's going on on the outside. We have something wrong, we can fix it, we buy cream, or whatever we do. We put makeup on and make it look good. But the inside, we kind of neglect an awful lot. And Absolutely. I think um, I think the body illusions, which is what your company right, is doing, right. and I think that is sort of a place where we should be more to Absolutely. exercise, to because, take care of the inside. Right, absolutely, because you can exercise from the age of 5 to 80s and 90s. So it doesn't matter. No, and it doesn't matter, because it's, it's, it's to our body. Yeah. That's right, it's all and here. It's, it, it's all, well, everything's in the head, you know, you make a, a, a left move, you make a right move, and, you know, I always say that if, if Israel had made the right move, they would have had all the oil. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. <laughs> That's very really true. Whether it was the left or the right, I don't know which one they were supposed to make, but if they made the correct one, they would have had all the oil. And I was like, how did they make that mistake? <laughs> That's right. But That's it's right. true. Yeah, That's absolutely. Yeah, yeah. So, now, then I'm, I'm going to bring this up because this was presented to me and he said, Nina, this is yours. And I said, what on earth is this? And it's sort of a, a long thing. And I'm going to let you um, explain what this is because this seems to be rather unique. Well. And I'm not a great exercise although person. Although this is like something very easy. I but, thought it was a tie, you know. I thought it was something, you know. A tie? One of those, you know, if one you were like eight feet, maybe. <laughs> but basically, this is primarily like a stretching band but you can also do exercises with it so and believe me if a person's not used to exercising believe me this exercise will give them a workout it will oh, absolutely see absolutely. simplest way which a lot of people love including myself Simplicity. And, and this is and this is something you can do in the house in 10 or 15 minutes but you could also take it with you anywhere yes you can in a hotel restaurant if you're waiting for the weekend here in the Elvis booth I mean we can we can make it happen. We can make it happen anywhere. Body Lusion Zinc no, can make Vic it happen. No, can make it happen anywhere, not necessarily me. That's right. <laughs> so anyway, so what do you do with this? Because you, you start, kind of put it underneath your foot and then you stretch it out. Well, basically, I mean, you can do curls with it. You can do shoulder press. You can do triceps. Um, you can work your rear deltoids, which is your, your third head back here. Because your shoulder has three yes, heads. You got one, two, and three. Most people always isolate the frontal and the medial head and the overhead press for you know all complete three heads, but the rear delt is always lacking in most people. Okay. Especially for women. And why is the exercise sort of? Your, why are you pointing this out? What is this? What, what well, I'm just doing? saying these are. That's this, what that will this do. This is a target area that you can isolate with these bands. Oh my goodness. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Wow. You can do squats with it. You can do a lot of different things, yep. but you have to know how to do it properly. And you actually give the training for this. Absolutely. Now, you know, I always love to brag about Victor because he actually was a um, NFL football player. And I love to mention that. That's why he looks so good. He looks lean. And you, you actually, I've got to do something else because I just can't help this. He, he was, uh, you were playing with your chest. Oh, uh, <laughs> he does this, this, is, this is an exercise called muscle control. And if you watch my left and right pectoral, you'll see that I can, I can make them contract while keeping an even face. So pay attention. Pay attention Are you ready? To the, I'm, I'm ready. I'm, I'm watching. See, See what he does? And you actually can make that work. I, 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 don't, I think this would, this would be a great exercise for women. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Am I supposed for to women? laugh? Am I allowed to laugh? <laughs> well, it's really a little harder for women, probably. Probably. You know what? That would be a funny sight to see women walking on the street and. <laughs> well, yeah, it's you know? <laughs> well, this is really getting very curious. <laughs> you see the things you can do with exercise. Well, you know, actually, I taught a class the other day, and I was, and I, it was totally focused on the upper body, and we were able to isolate um, all with the own body weight, and also with this band, back, chest, shoulders, biceps, tries. I mean, we did everything. The whole body. The whole, the whole upper, upper body. Whole upper body with just with this. Okay. Now, is the upper body more important? Well, that doesn't mean it's more important. But do you think it's more important to keep your upper body in shape than the lower body? No, it's a combination of both. A combination of because both. Because if you think about it, you use your legs every day. 
Well, yeah, because they're getting exercise. This Absolutely. is what I was saying. So you could use your legs. So really, to exercise your upper torso. But you got to keep your core strong too, because your core supports the lower and the upper, balancing everything else. Your body losing zinc. I can't keep. We got this your back, so give us a call. And <laughs> where can they call you? One eight hundred eight seven one six three ten. Awesome. Extension one for your free consultation. Oh, you got a free consultation. How? And I'll even throw in a that? free consultation, or not not just a consultation, but a free session so you can experience the difference. And you actually teach yourself. Um, do you teach a whole class or do you teach privately I and teach, individual? Uh, individual, semi private, and also group classes. Group classes. Right. I've had, I've had a class of 25, 30 people at once by myself. Okay. And you teach the whole class. That's yeah. like something you see on TV. Right. right. Hey, you know what? You should have a TV show with that. I'm working on that. Are you working it's, it's, on it? It's in the talks right now. It's in, it's it's in, in, the, it's in the process. Yeah, yeah. It's starting to get there. Well, you know, the thing about a large class like that, what, what makes me unique is I'll walk around and I'll critique everyone's form, you know, in the class instead yeah. of just standing in front and Hoping and just they all guiding get it. people to do yeah, things, just you know hoping what I mean? they get it. So you right. actually, so you stand in front like a, it's like a ballet dancer. You stand in front and then you critique some of them that don't quite get it off. Well, to the make people, them better. the thing is, the people who have bad form, I, I can cite them right away. I can see it right away. Okay. And I walk over and I'll, you know, realign their body so they can actually feel the muscle that they're isolating. And then they feel also they feel they can do it better because they're not really getting to what you're trying to teach them. So exactly. that's why they don't exactly. quite know how. So unless you do it absolutely correctly, you really right. don't reach the right muscle or the right part of the body. Right. You're trying to sort of, you know, in, in my case, it would be the whole body. <laughs> well, that's <laughs> what it's about, to total, total body total, training. See? Total body training. Total body training. That's right. That's, that's what right. we have to have. Well, Body Illusions is just amazing. How long have you, you haven't been in town that long, have you? I've been here two years full time. Two years and, full um, time. And I'm making my mark in town. Yeah. And yeah. Um, so people who know about Body Illusions Inc., now you know. So go to the website, which is bodyillusionsinc.com forward slash Las Vegas. Yeah, we'll make Check sure. Check out the website. I'll make sure with my producer who actually puts all this together, I'll make sure we can put that on, like a running thing. I don't know if he, he does that yet, but apparently he's got some loads of new instruments and new stuff going on with editing and the whole bit. So we're actually, uh, uh, we're, we're getting like you. We're getting known out there. We're getting, we're getting hey, a that's, lot of, That is the goal. Yeah, that is the goal. Yeah, the goal is getting known out there. Yeah, and yeah. it's very hard in Vegas because everybody in Vegas wants to be known. Believe me, and I'm like thinking, and well, yeah. I want to say, I I want to say one thing. There's there's a lot of lazy people out here in Vegas, which I'm realizing. Yeah, there are. And my, my goal is to reach out to these people in an effective way, which is through your, through your my show. Program and through your program. And through, my, you know, and through all my social medias and things like that. So if you ever go to my Instagram or my Twitter, you know, it's all motivational. Yeah. You know what I mean? Which motivational. Is, which, and it is. It's getting out there. You know, the harder the work, the harder you work, the luckier you become. Well, that's not so. The luck part is not in it. It's because you work hard. I've got a, right. another company in town that are doing absolutely incredible. But they work all the time. And everybody says, "Why are you working?" Well, because they're on time. And that's a great thing. And a lot of people aren't on time in Vegas. They run behind. Like they'll probably come to your class. 15 minutes later, not worry about it, but at the same time, they've now lost 15 minutes because are you going to give them an extra 15 minutes on the end? No. Well, see, this is why I have all my clients show up about 15, 20 minutes early to get the warm up properly so yes. when we, we can start on time and finish on time. Yes. So they always come 15 minutes early. Right. And I've noticed a lot of people in this town, and, and only, but I'm not knocking the town for that, it's because it's the, the lifestyle here. So, you know, a lot of, of, of Vegas doesn't start till 10, 12 o'clock. I'm not used to I that. I call them I'm... vampires. Yeah. <laughs> well, These are like nocturnal people. Well, they are. Yeah. But that's what Vegas is. Yeah. yeah. You know? I mean, they'll, they'll call me about Cena. You want to go out? It's like 9, 10 o'clock at night. Nina, well, you want to go I'm out? Not... I'm thinking, go out. <laughs> Get I'm, just, bed. I'm still on Chicago time. Yeah. I'm, well, I'm still on English time. <laughs> right, right. So, you know, what's, what's so funny about being here is when I talk to a person who is seasoned, Yes. then they'll say, well, if it's Wednesday, well, today is my Friday. I still haven't got that concept yet. No, I, oh yeah, that, I'm yes. still on Monday through Friday. Yes, you know, and so I haven't worked that one out yet. No, and I, me I'm still, I'm still trying to figure that out. What Friday is when it's Wednesday? Exactly. And they say this is like this is my Friday. And I'm thinking, what do you mean this is your Friday? It's Wednesday. Exactly. You're right. <laughs> but that's Vegas. Right. It's absolutely fine. But I wanted to mention, you know, getting back to the exercise. Yes. Yes. I want to mention that there's a basic exercise that people can do in their household, and not even realize it. So you're giving this away. He's actually yes. giving this away so to you. So basically, what it is, it's a squat with a chair. 
So for a lot of people who have weak quads, it's very important to know. When you say quads, what do you quadriceps, mean? Quadriceps, your, your thigh muscles here. Your thigh muscles. So just your so you say, I understand what quads your quads is short. Are. Quadriceps is the, the full name for it. Okay. And basically, if you think about it, everyone sits down in a chair. Yes, we all do. Everyone stands up. So if a person has weak quads, they can utilize the chair to make sure that they're sitting 90 degrees. And, when, and then when you stand up, because the proper alignment for a squat is basically feet about shoulder width apart, your knees over your toes, and your body is kind of like an L. Yes. You so know what I mean? So you're sitting up. Back. Right, you're sitting up, right, not leaned over. No. Because that will put stress and on your back. And then that means putting your back part exactly. to the back of the chair. Exactly. My father taught me that, right, and it was right. called sit up straight. That's right. So like back then when people used to put a book in their head and walk around. Yes. Oh yeah, I've done that. It's the same there. thing. So so the technique with exercise, I'll have a client focus on the spot in the ceiling and focus on that on that spot in the ceiling. That way it keeps it it keeps them upright in the proper alignment. Straight. Yes. And that's very important. Now the thing about the squat is as you st a person stands up, you they want to press off the heels to keep the stress off the knees. Because if you think about it when a person walks up the stairs the natural motion is the, off the ball of their feet. The ball of their feet is that's what so takes them. So the thing is, them. you want to walk up flat-footed. That way, you isolate the quads better. Oh, really? So, so the yes. so when you're flat-footed, it's better for the quad. Exactly. I didn't see, see. I just learned something. You learn something new every day. Body Illusions Inc. There you go. <laughs> I love it. And then I when you it. and then when you get to the top of the stairs, stretch your quads out. The yeah. quadriceps. There you go. Yeah. So that we just got a free lesson. That's just amazing. So don't forget to get in touch with Victor. Uh, body illusions in Vegas, and uh, you can get shape yourself up, you know. And trust me, with minimal equipment, you can get a full body workout. And this looks like it's not a big deal, but it will make you work if you do it right. Don't don't worry. I'm, I I I quite like this thing. On that, we're going to close out with Ninon doing. Doo! Look at this. Look, it does takes nothing. I could be sitting. You in can front see the of shape this. of her shoulders getting. Look at this. this look at that. Look, they're already. They're already. <laughs> <laughs> what is it? Shape up and ship out. I'm uh, shipping out <laughs> Vegas Live with Nina with Vector. This is amazing. You've got to get. Everyone has to have one of these. Um, see you next week. Take care.